How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to a, our second FIFA 21 video. We've got an inform Francesco Caputo, the uh, Italian striker from Sassuolo. And, uh, yeah, I mean, looking at his card, you don't really see anything that stands out necessarily. But, uh, you know, for a starter card, he's, uh, you know, pretty good. So obviously, some really good links. Very easy to link, uh, being Italian from the Italian League. Um, I'm not sure how his price will exactly react when the actual, you know, game comes out. But, you know, he is discard at the moment, which, you know, is definitely affordable for everyone. Especially how easy it is to get coins just from div rivs and placements. Uh, but, yeah, you look at his card. He's got, you know, some some pace, 86, uh, good shooting at 83, 66 passing, which is a bit low, 80 dribbling, and then 69 physicality. Three-star skills, four-star weak foot. He has the finesse shot trait. And, uh, yeah, this is the team we used him in. Four triple two. Uh, we linked him. You know, with that Pellegrini and Tonali. I actually did his ones to watch. Uh, I'm curious. Did you guys do him? Uh, I don't know. Because I remember Ndombele. Uh, he got that ones to watch. But he never really got any special cards. And that was just a waste. I think that was an objective, actually. But uh, tell me if you're doing the Sandro, car, uh, Sandro Tonali card. Because uh, I am curious. But, uh, yeah, we'll get into this this review. We'll uh, start out, obviously, with his pace. Um, you know, he's, he's obviously not rapid. But he's, you know, fairly quick. Uh, he's got the 84 acceleration and 86 sprint speed, so you know he can he can move. He has good mobility and is able to get past defenders with that pace. Uh, if you want, uh, I wouldn't say no to it. I'd probably boost it a little bit. You can uh, maybe use an engine, I think, or a hunter. One of the two uh, would probably work very well uh, in terms of his shooting. Uh, you know, he's got good finishing at 86. He's also got 88 attack positioning, which is fantastic. Uh, you can see here he drops into that space very well to uh, get open. And then he's able to use the finesse shot trait to get it past the keeper. So uh, he's got very good positioning, uh, good finishing. I don't think he's exactly clinical. And that's probably down to the low composure at 74. So he is inconsistent and definitely lacks that clinical edge. Uh, but the finesse shot trait is very nice and allows him to have, you know, variety in his shot. And then... Uh, 80 shot power, 74 long shots. I mean, you're not really going to be shooting from range from uh, with this guy, but, you know, he's really just going to be someone to roam around in the box to score goals. Uh, and then in terms of his distribution, his link-up play is actually not too bad, considering how bad, you know, his stats do look. Uh, he's got 73 short pass, 62 long pass, uh, but, you know, he did get a fair few assists for me. You can, have, you know, you can, of course, boost that with a chemistry style if you'd like. Uh, in terms of his dribbling and his on the ball ability 86 agility is pretty good he turns very well uh it doesn't feel clunky and uh, he's also got 81 balance which is decent 85 reactions which is important for a player like caputo uh you know to react to you know second chances those rebounds uh and you know kind of be a poacher so you know that's a very good stat uh he's also got 78 ball control 79 dribbling and like i said the three star skills so he's not exactly you know the most uh, fluid on the ball so you're not obviously going to be dribbling through the defenses with caputo uh but you know he's got the the technical ability to work and you know create chances and you know do what you need for your striker you can see some some pretty good close control there to get past the two center backs and then he finishes it with his weak foot into the bottom right corner um and then like i said 74 composure is a bit of a problem for me but you know it, it it's a bit inconsistent um, in front of goal, so you just got to keep that in mind. Uh, in terms of his physicality stats, they don't look very good. Um, besides his aerial abilities, he's got 87 jumping with the 82 heading accuracy, so maybe you can score some headers with him. I think I scored like once or twice in the air with him. Uh, and then his stamina at 70 is low. Um, I think at this stage of the game, it is manageable, but it's not fantastic. And considering he has high low work rates, you know, it's not like he's going to be sprinting all over the field, so uh, you know, that definitely helps out with. You know with the lower stamina and then he's got the 74 strength which i'd say is pretty decent for you know for his player build i guess and then the 52 aggression which is quite low uh which you can definitely consider as another con but you know overall i think for the price you know a discard inform he's a great starter player he provides great links maybe a good alternative to someone like uh immobile and uh you know i would definitely recommend trying him out because he uh he did fairly well for me so that's going to be my caputo review please like the video of course subscribe comment down below who you'd like to see next and thank you for watching